Iran has just revealed a jet, black stealth drone that is shocking modern air defense systems worldwide. This new aircraft shows up as tiny, unstable radar blips, sometimes not at all, leaving military analysts confused and alarmed. Today, we uncover how Iran built this invisible threat, what technologies make it so dangerous, and why global powers are suddenly scrambling for answers. Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we begin with a closer look at Iran's newly revealed jet, Black Stealth Drone, a platform that is creating serious concerns for modern air defense networks. This aircraft isn't just another experimental drone, it represents a major leap in Iran's pursuit of low observable technology. The jet, black coating, angular shaping, and compact airframe all signal that this platform was designed with stealth principles from the beginning. What makes this drone particularly intriguing is the way it reportedly behaves on radar screens. Early sightings show that radar operators detected inconsistent micro returns, the kind usually dismissed as birds or debris. This level of confusion is exactly what successful stealth design aims to achieve. Iran has invested significantly in drone manufacturing over the last decade, gradually moving from basic reconnaissance systems to more advanced strike capable aircraft. But this new platform suggests a shift toward high and stealth capabilities that only technologically advanced nations previously fielded. The drone's appearance raises important questions. How did Iran achieve this level of engineering? What foreign influences shaped its development? And perhaps most importantly, what does this mean for regional security? In this video, we will break down the drone structure, propulsion, stealth features, mission roles, and strategic implications to understand how Iran developed such a surprising and sophisticated aircraft. In this section, we examine the physical design and airframe engineering of Iran's jet black stealth drone. Stealth aircraft typically rely on blended surfaces, smooth body transitions, and carefully shaped contours to deflect radar waves rather than reflect them directly back to tracking systems. This drone follows the same philosophy. Its wing to body integration appears seamless, reducing structural edges that usually generate strong radar reflections. The aircraft's skin is reportedly constructed from composite materials, likely carbon fiber reinforced polymers combined with lightweight radar absorbent laminates. These materials reduce the overall weight while significantly lowering radar visibility. The matte jet black finish is another essential feature. Low observable coatings help absorb incoming radar energy and minimize thermal detection. Iran has previously experimented with radar absorbent paints, but analysts suggest this drone represents a more refined version of that technology. Although exact dimensions remain unconfirmed, satellite imagery and test range footage imply a medium-sized stealth drone capable of carrying internal payloads. The wing geometry includes serrated edges, a design used to disrupt uniform radar reflections and reduce acoustic noise during flight. Iran's drone program has historically relied on reverse engineering captured Western and Israeli drones, especially the US RQ-170 Sentinel. However, unlike older Iranian replicas that clearly resembled foreign platforms, this jet black drone looks more original, suggesting Iran has moved beyond copying and toward developing its own indigenous stealth architecture. Now we turn to propulsion noise reduction and thermal signature management, three critical elements of stealth performance. Unlike common propeller-driven drones, this new Iranian platform appears to use a compact turbofan engine, a choice that reduces audible noise and improves speed. Turbofan propulsion allows the aircraft to fly at higher altitudes with smoother acoustic characteristics, making detection by human observers significantly harder. One particularly notable feature is the drone's exhaust configuration. Analysts examining test footage noticed an unusually muted heat plume, indicating the presence of an internal cooling system that mixes ambient air with engine exhaust before release. This method reduces infrared emissions, making it difficult for heat-seeking sensors to detect the aircraft. The air intake appears recessed or partially hidden, a classic stealth technique that prevents radar waves from illuminating the engine's rotating fan blades. This approach is used in advanced stealth jets like the F-35 and B-2 Spirit, demonstrating that Iran is applying similar principles in a scaled-down configuration. Additionally, the drone's aerodynamic layout suggests efficient fuel consumption, supporting extended mission durations. Longer flight endurance means the drone can conduct intelligence gathering, battlefield mapping, or even strike missions deep inside contested airspace. Considering international sanctions, Iran's ability to modify engines domestically reveals a major advancement in its aerospace engineering capabilities. In this section, we break down the internal payload architecture and mission flexibility of Iran's jet black stealth drone. Unlike traditional drones that mount weapons externally, this aircraft appears to use an internal weapons bay an essential feature for maintaining a low radar cross-section. Internal bays prevent missiles, bombs, or sensors from creating reflective surfaces that could expose the drone to tracking radars. 
Analysts believe the compartment is modular, allowing crews to swap between surveillance equipment, electronic warfare systems, or precision guided munitions depending on mission requirements. This modular design greatly expands operational versatility. For reconnaissance missions, the Baykut House Electro Optical Sensors, Synthetic Aperture Radar Units, or Communication Interception Antennas. For strike missions, it may accommodate small diameter glide bombs or compact air to surface missiles similar to those already produced by Iran's defense industry. Serrated bay door edges also point to deliberate stealth shaping intended to scatter radar waves instead of sending them back to enemy receivers. Another advantage of an internal payload system is improved aerodynamics, which reduces drag and increases flight endurance. This suggests the drone was designed for long duration missions inside contested zones where exposure must be minimized. The decision to build such a system represents a strategic leap for Iran, demonstrating an ambition to match the operational capabilities of modern stealth platforms fielded by larger military powers. Overall, the payload architecture positions this drone as a multi-role asset capable of both covert intelligence gathering and precise, low visibility strikes. This section focuses on the radar evading capabilities of Iran's jet, black stealth drone, and how it interacts with modern air defense networks. Stealth is not simply about low visibility, it is about minimizing detectable signals across multiple sensor layers, including long-range surveillance radars, medium-range target acquisition systems, and short-range engagement radars. Analysts report that early radar detections of this drone often appear as weak, inconsistent micro blips, which operators may dismiss as environmental clutter such as birds debris or atmospheric anomalies. These inconsistent radar returns suggest the drone's airframe, coating, and wing shaping work together to scatter and absorb incoming electromagnetic waves. The matte jet black surface further reduces visual detectability during night operations, complementing its low radar signature. Another interesting observation involves altitude management. The drone reportedly employs low, level flight profiles to exploit radar horizon limitations, avoiding detection by ground-based systems until it reaches critical operational zones. Infrared sensors also face challenges due to advanced thermal, masking measures that dissipate engine heat before it becomes visible to targeting systems. Combining all these design elements, the drone can maneuver through multiple defense layers while remaining largely undetected a tactic that previously required more expensive or larger platforms. If deployed in swarms, multiple drones using similar stealth tactics could saturate radar networks, overwhelming even advanced regional air defense systems. These capabilities indicate a strategic shift in Iran's approach to modern aerial warfare and asymmetric defense strategies. As the situation intensifies, Hezbollah has shifted from indirect warnings to a bold and unmistakable display of force. In a newly released video, the group showcased its upgraded arsenal, including precision guided missiles, anti-ship capabilities, and long-range drones, sending a clear message to Israel, we are prepared for any escalation. This public reveal was not accidental. It was time calculated and choreographed to remind Tel Aviv that Hezbollah today is far more advanced than it was during the 2006 war. Among the weapons displayed, analysts noted the Feta class precision missiles believed to be capable of hitting high value Israeli targets with remarkable accuracy. Hezbollah also highlighted drone units that can bypass radar, electronic warfare systems, and even Iron Dome in certain scenarios. This is a direct response to Israel's increasing airstrikes on Hezbollah linked positions in Lebanon and Syria. Israel's political and military leaders watched the footage closely, understanding the message behind it. By revealing only a portion of its arsenal, Hezbollah is signaling confidence, showing that it is not afraid of escalation. Tel Aviv now finds itself debating whether to intensify pressure or step back from a dangerous red line. For Iran, this display reinforces its broader strategy, proving to the world that its regional allies are well equipped and ready for confrontation. The Middle East is entering a phase where even a single miscalculation could ignite a front that could spiral far beyond Lebanon's borders. In this section, we analyze the electronic warfare and communication systems of Iran's jet, black stealth drone, critical elements for operating in contested environments. Modern air defense networks rely on radar, signal interception, and jamming to detect and neutralize threats. To counter these measures, the drone reportedly uses encrypted frequency hopping communication links. This method allows the aircraft to change transmission frequencies constantly, preventing enemy systems from locking onto its signals. Analysts suggest the drone may also carry a compact electronic warfare sensor suit capable of detecting incoming radar emissions in real time. By interpreting radar signals, the drone can adjust its flight path and orientation to minimize exposure, choosing angles and altitudes that reduce detectability. This capability is particularly important when operating near integrated air defense systems, which combine multiple radar and missile platforms. Another aspect of the drone's electronic systems may include autonomous fail-safe modes. 
In case of communication loss, the aircraft can continue its mission according to pre-programmed instructions, maintaining stealth and completing surveillance or strike objectives. Some reports indicate it may also carry countermeasure payloads, such as small decoys, to further confuse radars and defensive interceptors. Overall, these advanced electronic warfare and communication features enhance the drone's survivability and effectiveness, allowing it to operate in areas previously considered too heavily defended. This section demonstrates that Iran is integrating not only physical stealth, but also electronic stealth capabilities, reflecting a sophisticated, multi-layered approach to modern drone warfare. In this section, we explore the operational range, endurance, and mission versatility of Iran's Jet Black Stealth Drone. Reports suggest that the drone can cover several hundred kilometers on a single sortie, a capability that allows it to operate deep inside contested airspace without immediate refueling or support. Its aerodynamic design, lightweight composite materials, and efficient turbofan engine contribute to extended endurance, enabling prolonged surveillance or strike missions. The drone's internal modular payload bay further enhances mission flexibility. By swapping equipment, it can be configured for intelligence surveillance, electronic warfare, or precision strike operations. This adaptability allows Iran to use a single platform for multiple strategic objectives, reducing the need for a large fleet of specialized aircraft. Analysts also note the potential for swarm tactics, in which multiple stealth drones operate simultaneously to saturate enemy defenses, create confusion, and increase the likelihood of mission success. The combination of range, endurance, and modular payload design indicates that Iran is moving toward a more sophisticated aerial strategy, where stealth drones can perform roles previously reserved for manned aircraft. Such versatility makes the platform a high-value asset for regional operations, from reconnaissance in hostile territories to precision strikes against critical infrastructure. Overall, this section highlights the drone's strategic potential and its ability to change the dynamics of modern air defense challenges, signaling a new era in asymmetric aerial warfare. In this section, we focus on the regional and global implications of Iran's new jet black stealth drone, particularly how its introduction is reshaping military calculations among rival states. Defense analysts argue that this drone represents more than just a technological advancement. It signals Iran's growing confidence in projecting power beyond its borders. Neighboring countries, especially those aligned with Western military alliances, are now reassessing their air defense strategies. Traditional SAM systems, which rely heavily on radar detection, may struggle to reliably track or intercept this low visibility platform. This creates a new layer of uncertainty, forcing militaries to invest in infrared sensors, passive detection networks, and more advanced interceptors. The drone's ability to conduct deep strike or long-range intelligence missions also increases Iran's strategic reach. Rival states fear that critical infrastructure, from surveillance bases to coastal facilities, could become vulnerable to previously impossible stealth penetrations. This shift may accelerate regional arms competition with states seeking counter-stealth solutions, improved radar arrays, and rapid response interception systems. Additionally, global powers monitoring the Middle East are likely to reinterpret Iran's military posture. The drone's advanced stealth autonomy and modular design suggest a level of engineering maturity that challenges long-held assumptions about Iran's defense capabilities. Some experts believe this development could influence NATO assessments, Gulf security doctrines, and even international negotiations surrounding Iran's military program. Ultimately, the drone introduces a new strategic variable, one that alters defense planning, escalates technological competition, and reshapes the balance of power across an already volatile region. In this final section, we examine the strategic lessons and broader implications of Iran's jet black stealth drone. This platform demonstrates that even under sanctions and technological restrictions, Iran has developed a drone capable of challenging advanced air defense systems. The combination of stealth shaping, internal payloads, noise reduction, and advanced electronic warfare systems indicates a comprehensive understanding of modern aerial combat. Analysts suggest that such drones could be deployed for both intelligence gathering missions and precision strikes, making them versatile tools for asymmetric warfare. Their presence increases uncertainty for neighboring countries, forcing them to rethink air defense networks, sensor coverage, and rapid response protocols. Moreover, the drone exemplifies a shift toward cost-effective stealth solutions as Iran achieves high-end capabilities without the expense of full-scale manned stealth aircraft. This may inspire other regional powers to pursue similar approaches, potentially creating a new era of drone-based strategic deterrence. For military planners worldwide, the development signals the importance of multi-layer defense systems capable of detecting low observable threats, it also highlights how innovation in smaller, modular platforms can challenge traditional assumptions about air superiority. As Iran continues to expand its drone program, the global defense community will likely monitor deployments closely, 
considering both technological and geopolitical ramifications. If you found this analysis insightful, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for the latest updates on military technology and global defense news. Hit the notification bell so you never miss a story.